everyone, it's Tiffany. I am here with the new Wubble Rumblers. I want to thank the company so much for sending these to me for free to check out with you guys. We have four different ones to look at. We have the, I almost said incredible, inflatable furious fist over here. We have the full Nelson, the air ninja, and the karate chop. So the fist and the karate chop kind of look almost alike, but obviously one's a fist and one's a, uh, just a regular hand for karate chopping. But it does say blow them up and battle. There is a pump included, which is great. I was like, I'm going to be out of air, out of breath by the time I'm done blowing these up. But they actually have a pump included. It says it's huge. I don't know how big exactly. But let's go ahead and turn at least one of these around. So these are all of the ones you can collect, all of the ones that we have here. Obviously, you could check out other types of wobbles, like the, the balls, the bubbles, whatever, etc. Wobble rumblers are good old rough, tough, rough and tumble fun <laughs> made from a squishy, squashy, super soft and lightweight material. It's more elastic than a typical inflatable. This is the ultimate accessory for play fighting. Slip one on and start handing out kooky karate chops and fun punches. Give a wacky high five, a silly handshake, or battle it out with your friends with a blow up ninja and wrestler. Kids will have hours of big bopping fun getting their rumble on with these larger than life inflatables. Adult supervision required. But I'm going to go ahead and take these all out of the box and inflate them and we will check them out. Now I do have all of them out of the box. In each box, I only took the pump out of one. These are the other ones, but in each box you get this. So you get an instruction manual, you get a pump, and you get the actual deflated product. So we're going to go ahead and check out how to inflate this together. Let's go ahead and open this pump up. It opens up here at the top. And this is what it looks like. You get a pump with each one. Don't worry, we already covered that. So this is the part where you would put inside and then this is how you would pump it like this. So let's go ahead and get this out. So it does seem pretty big too, like really big. I'm pretty excited. We might have to go off of the filming table to check these out when they're fully inflated. So let's see here. Oopsies. Hmm, I gotta find the valve first. <laughs> Okay, here's the valve, right here on the back of this guy. So it does have a little picture to show you insert that in there. Now let's look at the instructions though. So it does say unfold the rumbler and locate the valve, and then insert tip of pump into valve following instructions on the dire directions on the diagram. Gently push the nozzle through the opening until it's fully inserted. While holding the valve with the pump in place, move the pump up and down with the other hand until your rumbler is fully inflated, and now rumble. And here's a closer look at all the ones we have. And then these are some other ones, groovy wobbles that you can collect. And that is it. So we're gonna go ahead and follow the instructions here. It does say to insert this way. And I think that's fully in. Seems like it's working. So now at this point, I will be back after everything's inflated and we will check it all out. I have everything inflated. Now, actually, the first of all, I would much rather have those traditional like blow up nozzles instead of the pump because it was a lot of work on my hands. But I mean, that's because I had four of them, so I don't know if it was better. Just left, but anyway. So actually, these hands are my favorite out of all of them. This one in particular, this punching one, seems to hold up quite well. As also, uh, I will talk about the other ones in a little bit. Um, they just say wobble rumblers on them here and then it just has this hand hole right here and it's just it's pretty simple self-explanatory um right where is it here is where you fill it up you just put the pump in there and it works all right and then let me really have a place for all of these <laughs> this one is our next one the next whoop the next hand one we have this straight hand actually where's the finger wait a minute is it like a it makes sense i think it's like hi yeah hi yeah <laughs> um there's like the thumb right here or no over here there's the thumb anyway really really cool uh same thing pretty much the same size as well still my favorite though is the, the first one this is probably second in line and now my hand won't oh, there we go <laughs> 
Um, let me put this over here while we talk about this guy. This guy I actually had quite a bit of trouble with blowing up the body. This one was the uh, different, different in the sense of it had two different blow up areas. So the head and the body. Now the body I've been having trouble like staying inflated. I've blown this up to at least I think three times now while I was blowing everybody else up. Um, but the head is doing great. It's really good. Um, not too shabby, but I don't know if I just had like a faulty valve or it just doesn't usually stay inflated that well but if it does deflate um, these will deflate especially with the type of valve that they have um, they're not like not fully fully sealed as if it were to be one of those plugged up ones so if it deflates a little bit during play you just got to pump it up quickly but let me move on to the last one which is this guy I guess he kind of had the, a little bit of a deflating problem as well he's not as inflated as when I started but I like his tattoo. This is Crusher. It looks pretty cool. Uh, he has his W Wubble belt on and he has his crazy wrestling, ready, ready face, ready to wrestle, ready to fight face. Uh, and then he just has oops, his feet down here, which are kind of flat at the bottom. He kind of stands up a little bit if you prop him. Well, you have to prop him up against something because he's not going to stand up by itself. He just elbowed me in the face. But anyway. Uh, like I said, out of all of them, the first one, the fist, is definitely my favorite. It definitely seems more sturdy, durable. It stays inflated longer. The people, I guess we can say, didn't stay as inflated as long, but they're still, they're still kicking it. They're still doing a good job. But anyway, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe, and I will see you next time.